Welcome to this episode of Intermediate Financial Accounting 2's Our Community Counts. In this episode, we'll be looking at a company that engages in significant lease transactions. Air Canada is involved in a host of other initiatives in the community across the country, including the National Gay Pilots Association, the International Gay and Lesbian Travel Association, Pride at Work, Fondation BBCM, Fondation Metropolis Bleu, Canadian Gay and Lesbian Chamber of Commerce, and so on. This is a quote from an Air Canada media release dated in October 2018 and highlights the breadth uh, and length to which the company has gone to include uh, other groups, in this case particularly gay groups, uh, in its work as customer base and employees. Air Canada is a prominent Canadian airline trading on the TSX. It operates flights between numerous airports on various continents. The company has been named one of Canada's best diversity employers for four consecutive years by Media Corp. Air Canada has made a commitment to nurture diversity in its teams using recruitment partnerships with groups representing First Nations, LGBTQ+, people with disabilities, and other communities. This highlights one of the potential tools in the toolbox that a company can use to increase what it's doing within the diversity and inclusion space, recruiting partnerships. And here is another quote from the company's annual report. Air Canada pursues a comprehensive diversity management strategy with the goal of ensuring an inclusive and diverse workplace based on respect, where all employees can utilize their talents. Air Canada established a target of women representing at least 30% of senior managers by 2020 and has exceeded it. In addition, one third of Air Canada's executive committee is comprised of women. This shows the deployment of another tool, a target or quota for individuals of a particular group and their representation in senior management or executive committees. Air Canada, of course, as a major airline, engages in lease transactions with major aircraft manufacturers such as Boeing to acquire aircraft for reuse on its routes. As part of its continuing commitment to diversity, Air Canada is a member of the 30% Club and a signatory to the Catalyst Accord 2022, whose objectives it is to increase the average percentage of women on boards and in executive positions in corporate Canada to 30% or greater by 2022. Currently, three out of the 11 directors for Air Canada are women. This shows yet another tool in the toolbox that's available to companies joining and encouraging other companies to form group agreements that have targets or commitments to diversity and inclusion. If you'd like to know a little bit more about Air Canada and its diversity and inclusion initiatives, please see the annual reports included on the Investor Relations page.